Hey guys, welcome back to my next video. Today, we're going to be doing an exhaust cutout. I finally ordered the exhaust cutout from eBay, and it's arrived, and it's going to be amazing. The main issue I've had with trying to install this exhaust cutout is that the local Bunnings did not have a welder that would weld stainless steel. So the solution is we're going to go to an exhaust shop, get them to do it for me, and then we'll do the install, and, and we'll also do some comparisons between the drilled exhaust and the exhaust cutout. So in the kit, what it comes with is the actual valve motor, the Y pipe, as well as a few flanges and gaskets. Alrighty guys, we're on to day two of the exhaust install. So yesterday I got a shop to install the Y pipe for me, as Rex and I did not have the ability to do it. From the looks of it, they did a pretty good job. They've uh, fabricated a whole sort of section before the muffler. They've installed my exhaust cutout. Now it's just time to wire the bad boy up. So the actual wireless transmitter that I received came with a 12 volt connector. Now I don't particularly want to wire this through the car, so the solution I've come up with is chop it off here and hook it up to the battery, which is just over that away. Moment of the truth. Rip. So as you can see, we copped a W there is a positive and negative wire. So we've stripped the main wire with about five centimeters worth of exposed positive and negative red and black wire. We've then hooked it up to the extension. Now we're gonna hook this up to the battery and this up to the valve and give it a test run. So Rex and I just managed to wire it all up. It's all connected to the battery now. Uh, we're just gonna do initial reactions. As you can see, the actual pipe is just straight open. Basically, a muffler delete. It so is a muffler delete, yeah. This, this should be uh, quite interesting to see what it sounds like. Oh Jesus, it's gonna be so loud. It's gonna be so damn loud. You okay? Yeah. Oh God. Oh God. Jules, stop. So the next step of what we're going to do is we brought up the, the car's sort of back carry area and we are going to drill right through here and we're going to feed the wire through here and then that leads straight to the battery. Yeah. Oh. Are you going straight through here, huh? Yeah, right? So as you can see, the motor has been connected to the rear of the boot. We've managed to make the wire very flush. Now it's time to plug the second hole that I made by accident with some hot glue. Thanks guys for watching my exhaust cutout video. I'm now going to show you some before and after videos of when the exhaust was drilled and now with the exhaust cutout. So those clips you just saw were the before shots. Uh, got our good driver over there. So that was the drilled exhaust. The next shot you will see is the actual fully, not straight piped, but muffler deleted exhaust. Get low when you get an all right? Oh, jeez. 